Well, this next story is the kind of good news we all need to hear. It's a math competition in which winning the gold is as prestigious as winning at the Olympics. Four Bay Area students came home today from the 2009 Math Olympiad for Girls. Education reporter Leanne Melendez met up with them today at San Francisco International Airport. Their fans, a small number of them, were in place with banners. The award-winning teenagers tried to impress them by putting on their medals while getting cues from this TV crew. Their knowledge of math has given them this newfound fame. In other fields like music or like writing literature and stuff, like you see like plenty of female figures, but like usually like in math and science, like there's like not that much like female figures. Come on. This is video from the Simons Foundation, which supports research in science and math. The eighth annual girls' math competition took place in China. Other countries yeah. like Russia, Wait, the Philippines, and Hong Kong also sent teams. The U.S. had seven members. That's them in the green T-shirts. Four were from San Jose and Cupertino. It was a proof contest, so you had to prove eight different problems in eight hours. Broken up over two days. Shi Yu Lee of Cupertino High got six out of eight right. That got her a gold medal. Even with her brain power, Cynthia Day was a little nervous. Oh, well, I was afraid I would do particularly worse on the team, but it turned out okay, so yeah. She still managed to get a bronze medal. These girls are doing away with the notion that boys are better in math than girls. Remember Barbie doll telling us how she felt about math? Math is hard. The Berkeley-based Mathematical Sciences Research Institute sponsored the U.S. team. As the years go by, you look at the number of women that are, that are professional mathematicians, that are, that are getting their postdocs and PhDs and so forth, that's steadily increasing. And it's not because humans are changing, right? It's because the society is changing. Carolyn Kim was on the U.S. team. She says her world isn't TV? only about math. Um, I actually watch uh, a lot of TV. <laughs> I probably watch more than I should. She's now Harvard bound. Here's a word of advice from Patricia Lee, an incoming MIT freshman. There is no stereotype, so don't let it hold you back. Good advice. This is the second year in a row that every member of the U.S. girls math team has won a medal. And, of course, it's pretty impressive that most of the U.S. team is made up of girls from the Bay Area. In the newsroom, Leanne Melendez, ABC 7 News. That is great news, yeah, Leanne. Sure Thanks is. so much. Yeah, so move That's over, awesome. Barbie. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Step aside. Yeah. All right, Sandy Patel is here.